In this video, you will learn how to fix Messenger floating video call not working on Android. Many users enjoy using the floating video call feature because it allows them to chat while doing other things on their phone. However, sometimes this feature can stop working for various reasons. But don't worry, I will guide you through some simple steps to get it working again. To get started, swipe down from the top, just like this, and then tap on the gear icon at the top right corner. Once you're on the settings page, scroll down until you find apps. Tap on it to proceed. In this section, look for a search button at the top right corner. Tap on it and type in Messenger, then hit search. Select Messenger from the list of search results to open its app info page. Now that you're on the Messenger app info page, tap on notifications. Make sure to toggle on the switch next to allow notifications. This enables notifications for incoming calls and messages. Next, ensure that the allow sound and vibration option is selected. Also enable all notification types, lock screen notifications, badges, and pop-ups to make sure you're fully alerted when someone tries to reach you via video call. After adjusting your notification settings, go back to the main Messenger app info page. Scroll down until you find an option called, Appear on top. When you've found it, tap on it and toggle on the switch next to, Allow permission. This permission allows Messenger to display its interface over other applications you may be using simultaneously. We're almost done. Now return once more to your Messenger app info page. Look for an option labeled, Picture in Picture. Tap on it and enable it by toggling on, Allow permission. This feature lets Messenger create a small window that floats over other apps when you're making video calls or after leaving the app. And there you have it. Once these settings are adjusted correctly, your floating video call feature should be up and running smoothly. If issues persist even after following these steps, consider checking for updates or reinstalling Messenger as a last resort. So that wraps up this tutorial. If you have any questions about this whole process, please let me know in the comments section below. And if this video helped you out, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more tutorial videos like this one. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.